Abracadabra? That's rare.
Bob sells PP parts. Shall we upgrade? A clothing store in Akihabara? That's rare. You're back early. How did it go? Ooh, not terribly well, judging by your long faces. Well, yeah. Seems you've got one missing. Come, have a seat and tell me what happened. My, you are in quite a pickle. Saki was really trying to make friends with Katomi, too. Like she genuinely meant it. It's tough being a girl her age. Even the most trivial encounters can leave giant rifts in their wake. I'm back. I guess. Pinku! No luck, I take it? Yeah. Dang. This is the first time she's ever run off without me like this. Hey, Pinkoon, would you mind telling us a little more about her? I'd like to know more about her, too. Yeah? Like, why is she so dedicated to nullifying the delusions? Simple. Saki feels a way stronger sense of justice and righteousness than anyone else. And she's gentler than all of them. It all started when we ran into each other inside a delusionscape. I was under attack by a really scary grand phantasm when Saki showed up out of nowhere and saved me. I mean, I'm clearly not human, and to the layman, I'm a monster, so I expected to be thrown out with the bathwater. But Saki came up to me, saw that I was all alone, and said to me, Let's be friends. Friends, huh? It's that kindness that makes her want to nullify the delusions, too. She'd always tell me, Delusions are dangerous things that encroach upon reality, and I am a chosen one. For the good of the world and everyone in it, it's my duty to nullify them. You've heard her say that kind of stuff before. We all have. So Saki kept those thoughts in her head and kept on smashing delusion after delusion, all in the name of justice. And all without ever being able to talk to anyone about it. Sounds like you two have been giving this your all for quite some time. Not us two. Just Saki. All I can do is cheer her on. She really is a straight shooter, huh? That must be why Katomi's personality affected her so much. They're like oil and water. The truest villain to a straight shooter like her, however, is internal conflict born of her own heart. Yeah. It'd hurt to be shouted down for an act of kindness you truly believe in. But that's why we can't give up on her. We've got to find Saki, no matter what! Of course. That's what friends do. I wouldn't be standing here today if it weren't for Saki. Huh. Same here, I guess. You... Looks like Saki's not the only one with kindness in her heart after all. Kanata, perhaps it's your day to shine. Ah, certainly. I think it would be a perfect opportunity. Though I can't say I'm entirely confident that I'd be much help. Hold on, what are you